The man of today, the man of the final second of the preliminaries is Jan Christoph Duda in the final second. Qualifying. Congratulations, Jan Christoph. Yeah, thank you. All right. So you had a few minutes now to sort of settle down, but is your pulse still kind of high? Yeah, of course. I mean, I'm very surprised I actually managed to pull it off. Um, yeah, I was kind of happy that I'm playing young, young opponent and ambitious, and it was obvious that at least he wouldn't take a perpetual. So, um, yeah, once you have a night, you always have some hope uh, when it's in, in time scramble. So, yeah, but in general, it was like very lucky by me. Actually, also that I managed to be to be ding earlier. Yeah. Like I have, I didn't expect it at all, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, obviously very nervous day, but yeah, I'm happy to be there. <laughs> Definitely. Can you take us through your emotions during that last game against Gukesh? I mean, you were winning, you were losing, you were winning again. And I don't know if you were aware of the results from, from other games, especially Ali Reza Verusia. Yeah, I didn't check uh, other games. I just esti estimated that I have to win mm -hmm. to qualify. That was my priority. Uh, yeah, I think I was much better after the opening. Actually, after Bishop takes e4, d5, uh, at least much, uh, much, much better. And, um, excuse me. And, um, yeah, but then obviously I could have like played many in many ways. First of all, I could have just um, got a much better endgame, I think, just um, just without calculating anything. That would make sense. And I wanted to play it like uh, as soon as possible, but obviously decided to go for something sharper. And obviously, yeah, I mean, obviously it was working for me, but I blundered this rook d5 move. And after that, I mean, um, yeah, I was worse, probably even close to losing and was just trying to, to create some threats and yeah, but once he didn't checkmate me, yeah, when the rook um, got traded, then I thought that I may have some chances, actually. I mean, when I uh, took the pawn on c2, because it's easy to over push this with black, I think. Because, okay, if I'm not getting checkmated, then one day, hopefully, I will march with my, with, mm -hmm. with my, with my pawns, as actually happened in the game. So... Yeah, I mean, there are always some chances in this kind of position. But obviously, I should have won in error. Like, I misplayed it totally. Yeah. So you actually had quite an emotional day because you lost two games in a row. What did you tell yourself to recover from that? Yeah, I actually didn't say anything. I <laughs> didn't. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, I, I didn't expect to win uh, against Ding, to be honest. And I thought it's all gone. Um, yeah, I was very upset with both of these games against Ladar Temiev that I didn't play bishop c3 move, which was like the only chance in the position. Um, yeah, after that, I was totally busted, I think. Mm -hmm. And obviously against Adiban, I mean, I I didn't calculate well in this game, but I was also very um, like low on time and he had like four minutes more. but. Yeah, I didn't have good positions, but uh, position, but obviously with some chances, because there are there were many past pawns in that game, and yeah, but I mean, I should have taken a draw. Obviously, I played this f5 move through the interior, like what for? And after king f4, I'm just busted. So mm -hmm. yeah, that was very, very, very like stupid game. Um, I just got confused, I think, on a long time. Yeah, and after that, I thought it's. It's gone forever. <laughs> and Jan Christoph, you mentioned that you didn't expect to win against Ding. It looks like you're playing Ding actually yeah. in the quarterfinals. Will you be recovering tonight or will you be preparing for him already? Yeah, I have no idea, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, now it's obviously a bit more difficult to play against Ding because um, yeah, he's not playing in the midnight of his time. So uh, that's <laughs> that's a bad thing. But yeah, I'm very happy to play Ding. Actually, to play anybody, uh, a part of Wesley So, so <laughs> <laughs> who is always like winning against me all the time. <laughs> so, I'm looking forward to this match tomorrow, and yeah, hope it will be a good fight. All right, well, Jan Christo, we're so so happy for you for qualifying, and looking forward to see you again tomorrow. Congratulations again. Thank you. Thanks for joining us.